the clock, you know what time it is. YouTube, Super your Reggie Reggie, you don't need a clock to know what time it is. Even though today is Monday, today I'm recording on Easter, so I want to send a happy Easter to my people out there. I hope you enjoyed your day thoroughly. Now let's get into this review. Today I went to Burger King and noticed they got a sourdough sandwich out. And I'm saying, hmm, let's see how sour this dough is. It looked like regular bread. So this, this is the sourdough bread. It looks like your traditional bread. A little thicker, but it looked like bread you get out the grocery store and toasted it a little bit. It's kind of wide. It reminds me of French toast. When you get you a nice piece of French toast, that's about as thick as it you want it to come at least. I'm not gonna say as thick as it comes, but that's how you want it to look. Presentation wise, this looks like a seven year old made it. I ain't gonna lie. It just don't look very special or appeasing once I flip the bun over. And they got some kind of special sauce up here. Orange, like a bright orange, like the, um, if you watch Nickelodeon back in the day, the same color orange they used in their font, that's the orange that the sauce got going on. Let's do it. I don't taste anything sour from it. And I just don't know why they call it sourdough. It just tastes like a Whopper with regular bread. So imagine you going home, taking the bun off the Whopper, replacing it with bread that's in your house and then eating it. That's all the sandwich is. On a scale of the pay, let's enjoy the Burger King, your sourdough sandwich are the Air Jordan 2s. Why? Because even though it's a decent shoe, it's just not as good as the Air Jordan 1. This sourdough sandwich is good, but it's not as good as it is with a traditional bun. So thanks for rocking with your boy, Ray Drew Ranger. If this is your first time, don't make it your last time. Hit that subscribe button, come check me out again next week. And until then, I'm signing out. Peace.